All right, in this video, we're gonna talk about automations. This tab right here, where we have rules and workflows. Let's try to understand how they work and how you can use them the best way. So if you go to rules, here is where you have, let me remove that. Here's where you have all the rules that you've created. And these rules, you are gonna be able to find them once you go to funnels, select the funnel and automation rules, so now here, in this case, you're going to be able to find the automation rules that we have. So for example, select automation rules. And every time that you create a new automation rule right here, okay, so you have exceeded the limit because of, um, because of my other account. So let's go ahead and filter. Let's go to test automation. So just the automation. Try to see where it is. One second. And all these things is actually something that for you to also you know, be able to troubleshoot. So first funnel, automation, there you go. So this one here, we have a new automation right here, right? So we have a tag right here. When it happens, it's, it, it's the tag to book ebook, okay? So let's go to the rules. And now here, this is exactly what happened. Like in the first funnel copy, which is this one, first funnel copy, uh, we are going to do add a tag ebook. So this is the rule that we have. We can also create rules right here, okay? which you select the specific trigger by clicking here and you add the specific trigger and then the specific action by selecting the action that you have here. Okay, so you can create it manually beforehand or you can create them inside the specific, um, the specific funnel. What I do 100% of the times is I do it inside the automation rules for the specific funnel. I don't do it anywhere else. The main reason why is because that way is a lot easier and then you can go ahead to the specific tag on uh, the specific um, the specific rule on this page and edit and customize it. You don't need to really pay close attention to these small texts right there. Okay, you don't really need to worry about that. Okay, so this is what happens inside this rule, and you can go ahead and you can add other stuff and you know uh, play around with that. No, no, no problem at all. Okay, but in these rules, this is what you have. You have all the rules right here. You can adjust it, you can create them, you can uh, filter by specific type of, of rules if you want to. I rarely use these ones. By the way, I've never, you know, really touched here. Um, but, you know, you have it, the option, and you can create it here. But I rarely do this. I only do this on specific funnel steps, okay? Much, much easier. 